Count on LEX 18 News. Coming up, we're live in Lexington at one of the 13 regional unemployment offices that opened across the state today to get people who have struggled with their benefits some in-person help. Plus, the push for more COVID-19 vaccinations in the state. And the governor says meeting his goal of 2.5 million people vaccinated could actually be met quickly. This is LEX 18 News at 6. Good evening and thanks for joining us at 6. I'm Angie Bevan in for Nancy Cox. And I'm Larry Smith out here at the Kentucky Career Center. It's one of the offices that opened today as the state is trying to get people in front of real life uh, people to try to help get uh, the unemployment benefits that you so richly deserve. You know, LEX 18 for the past several months has been working to try to help you get your uh, unresolved unemployment benefits uh, taken care of. And so we're thrilled to be here today and talk to some people actually uh, getting that done by talking to a live person. Every time we sit down and talk with somebody, it's been um, you know, kind of the same thing. There's been one small thing that happened. They can't get a hold of somebody and now they can. Hopefully now help is on the way. As Angie mentioned a moment ago today, 13 offices opening all across the Commonwealth, including Lexington, Moorhead, Somerset, Hazard and Covington, all of which have been closed the past three years. Now this comes on the heels of the governor shutting down the system for four days to deal with massive fraud as hackers were changing pins and redirecting needed funds elsewhere. All of that adding to residents frustrations. We spoke to one man who has been waiting for two years and finally his case has been resolved. They told me they had to backdate some information where I went in and put, put some information in wrong and told me about five days that she see payments coming through. It is very frustrating uh, because uh, every time you log into the website, the first second uh, you, you want to schedule an appointment, it will throw you out and it doesn't do anything. Oh, that Last gentleman there expressing the frustration of so many, and we have heard you say the, exactly the same thing that thousands of emails that we were we uh, have gotten. But again, hopefully now help is on the way as we've seen so many people come away now with their situation that have been taken care of. In Moorhead, many were leaving the city's in-person unemployment office with some good news today. LEX 18's Michael Burke was there and has more from Rowan County, where a handful of people received the answers and the insurance money that they received. From months of frustration. Every time I called, every time I tried to get online, it sent me somewhere else. I mean, it's been awful. To the relief of finally having a resolution. I'd have payments coming in three to five days. A roller coaster of emotions, and it all happened inside this small office off Highway 60 in Rowan County. The state opened this satellite unemployment office this morning so that claimants could have the benefit of an in person experience with a caseworker. Most left with the answer for which they've waited months. It is resolved. Meaning the insurance benefit Danita so desperately needs is now on the way. They told me that it could be possibly the beginning of the week. The state's unemployment office in Frankfurt had been besieged by claims as a result of COVID-19 related layoffs. Danita's husband is also out of work, but his claim was settled long ago, so they've managed to get by. Her portion will now help tie up the other loose ends. Same for Ms. Royce. I am very relieved yeah. very, and grateful. They are really wonderful in there. Anita hadn't yet experienced if that's true or not, but she had hope before being called on for her appointment. I hope I don't get another runaround today. Those we spoke with got the opposite of that today. Months of frustration and despair alleviated in a matter of minutes. Oh, I'm real grateful. I'm really grateful. In Rowan County, Michael Burke, LEX 18 News. Well, once again, there in Moorhead here in Lexington, two of the 13 sites open. That's hundreds of cases each day that can be resolved. And again, much needed funds, uh, needed insurance benefits in the pockets of so many Kentuckians. You know, there are some encouraging signs when it comes to unemployment or across the country as more people get vaccinated and COVID restrictions are eased. Last week, the number of people applying for unemployment benefits dropped sharply. 576,000 people filing claims, the lowest number since the pandemic began. However, those numbers still significantly higher than they were before the pandemic. Kentucky's Education and Workforce Development Cabinet releasing its numbers for March 2021 today. The preliminary numbers showing the jobless rate in the state was down 0.2 percentage points from February at 5%. However, it is still up 0.8 percentage points from one year ago. 
Nationally, the unemployment rate for March was 6%, down from 6.2 reported uh, in February. That's the numbers uh, as they are right now. So, but once again, this is still step one. Be sure to keep on uh, sending in to us anything that you uh, need. Try to reach out for your claim. Unemployment at WLEX.TV, and we'll continue to send those numbers on the unemployment office. But as we send it back into you, Angie, the good news is a lot of smiles coming out of these doors today. Hopefully, the start of some good things to come for many Kentuckians. Let's go back to you.